All right, so I got to show you guys this hilarious bug that I found out. So first of all, you can see the hawk on my shoulder, yes? Now watch this. So we're going to go invisible on the bat, okay? And then we're going to hit R, which will throw my shoulder pet off. Now the, the hawk is still invisible. Watch. <laughs> Look, it's just full on invisible right there. It's on my shoulder and it's still invisible. It gets better. It gets better. Watch this. <laughs> wait for it. Wait. How do, where's the crosshair? There it is. Okay, wait, watch. <laughs> this is so silly. It's just a floating bag. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, so there you go, guys. Just a weird little bug that you can do. Um, it probably works with other shoulder pets. It's just the fact that they can pick up the bags is hilarious. But anyway, yeah, um, the way to reset that is to obviously just you could reset it with your bat or you could just leave the fear hawk there and just leave the area for just a few minutes and come back. Um, anyway, so we're going to go ahead and go on over to Asgard once more today, because yesterday when I was over there, I actually spotted some R direwolves and I'm thinking let's get ourselves a little pack of them. They look really cool and eventually I'd love to do some mutations with them, but for the moment, let's just try and tame some high levels and just wreck some havoc over here. And maybe they could be my little guard dogs for my base, considering the fact that, well, I mean, we haven't had any incidents recently, but you, you never know. You really never know. So yeah, that is going to be the plan. Before we do that, we want to check out this aberration cave once more. Whoa, is that a rock drake in here? I had no idea they spawned in here. All right, I think we should be safe to grab this. Oh my, are you actually kidding? Ascended Baryonyx Saddle Blueprint, no way. We got one more drop over here. Honestly, the yellow drop's been giving me better stuff than this red drop has, so I don't know what that's all about. And how many ravagers do we have here? Is it just two? No, there's lots more right there. Okay, I had to kill them all and we've got their Xeno Saddle. Okay, pretty good. Amazing. All right, now let's head on over to Asgard. All right, so we're over here on Asgard, and it's a beautiful sunrise right now. Um, I'm going to head over to where I've seen the wolves before. By the way, there are beaver dams over here as well, which is great. Just like this main little river here down from the obelisk. Actually, really close to the obelisk. So, um, yeah, I have seen the wolves that are, like, over in this direction here. Um, I did see a 174 yesterday. It could also still be here, which would be great. Uh, if not, though, we could look around for some. You can pick them up with the bat, which is great. So they're going to be pretty easy to get. We also have some more Andrew Sarkis over here as well. I might at some point try and see if we can get a better health staff from those dudes. Because we did tame up a couple in the last episode. They're just such a pain to tame, if I'm going to be honest. Like, the mini game's cool and all, but I just keep messing it up. So I just kind of was like, yeah, we're, we're done. We're, we got enough. But yeah, maybe I'll try and get better at it at some point. This is nice little uh little display right here. Ooh, what's that like stone thing in the middle? Okay, wait, no, that's a bone. Oh, that's like a little skull right there as well. Let's go over in this direction. I think this is where I saw the wolves. And yeah, there's that 174 I saw yesterday. There was another one with it, but I don't know if it's still here. Let's just pick it up though. Oh crap, no. I should not be using the life drain. Um oh, here's the issue. This is exactly how I figured out about the um the issue with the feared hawk. Uh, making it like invisible and everything so basically uh you can't hold down r when you're on that because if you do that you're gonna drop your your pet right ah hello <laughs> get out of here I'm very surprised i can pick these things up by the way and i have heard that these guys are one of the best things to feed to desmodus so we'll probably do that in the future but for the moment this little piggy needs to go away send him off to the market or something here we go boom all right, so yeah, anyway, let me let me attempt to just hold down R. Yeah, even if you touch the R button, it just immediately goes there. So let's turn off the lifesteal. Um, that's kind of disappointing. I, I have so many buttons, you know? Like, why can't they just put it somewhere else? I don't know. Anyway, uh, where was that wolf gone? Did it start following me? I think it might have. Uh, yeah, it might have went down here. Do we have it down here anywhere? Little wolf, where'd you go? Oh, is that it? Oh my, dude, it's freaking blending into the ground. There we go. Oh, it's hitting me a lot, though. I'm totally not even holding that thing. What the hell? <laughs> it's just like in my in my gravity, I guess. Um, I actually don't even know where I'm taming this. Uh, let's go over to this little village at the lake over here. Could be a safe spot inside of there or something. I don't know. I didn't think this far ahead. Guys, go ahead. Do me a favor. Hit the like button if you find yourself enjoying this one. Um, you know, these episodes are just... <laughs> Lots of bad things are happening. Um, and this is one really bad thing right now. We are super hurt. You need to stop hitting me, bud. Oh, it doesn't happen. Okay, wait, wait. Yeah, it doesn't happen when I fly like that. So let's like fly sideways. No, okay. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let me let me try and see if we can like swoop down. 
This is getting so annoying. He's he's just tearing my bat apart. Um, okay, where the hell is the little village? Is it over there? Okay, here we go. We'll do that. <laughs> we'll just kind of try and go forward a little bit. He's not hitting me. That's good. I should have chosen a better spot over there or something. Come on. Okay, buddy. Wait, wait, wait. Can I? Oh, no. I can't go invisible when he's in my thing, probably. Ooh, crap. All right. Well, at least we can heal for a second. Um... We just basically need for this dude to like eat a couple blood packs which just happens randomly you can't force feed them at all so we just need to wait for him to eat one and then i think his health goes up by 500 per pack but there's a massive cooldown so i think i'll probably just feed some of these yeah he still has not eaten the blood pack can he eat these is that even oh there we go whoa it just went up fully oh he ate oh he ate like 40 of them i think yeah interesting interesting okay where the hell did the wolf go <gasps> wait, wait wait where did it go okay i thought it was over there eating that anki here it is though <laughs> okay well that's super weird i don't understand the healing on, on these guys i think they just eat as many blood packs as they want then i could have sworn i had that timer up here one time though so that's kind of confusing but it is what it is i mean he ate like 40 and healed so that's perfect try and get over there as fast as we can what happens if i just go like sideways kind of like pointing up does this work it does work <laughs> it's so strange I could just imagine if somebody was like on the ground like watching me do this it would look so odd all right yeah that's not working out so yeah, anyway there's like this big ass village in here i don't know if there's creatures in here that's the only thing hopefully not but maybe i can find a spot to kind of trap him in here or something or fly him directly into this freaking church or something can we do that oh <gasps> we actually can no way oh that's amazing okay well let me just I, i'll just like latch here and we'll can we go invisible wait i can't even okay <laughs> let's uh okay where is he there he is all right let me go invisible boom <laughs> you can't see me anymore i'm not here okay that's actually kind of insane that you can come into these buildings like you can just fly creatures inside that's pretty good all right are we okay i don't think he's aggro anymore oh he's totally aggro again i forgot that you stop being invisible when you do that um okay well i do have my net gun but I don't really want to use that. I I'm thinking maybe we can kind of just like grapple here or something and then wait for him to like torpor run. I don't know. Uh, you know what? I might actually be able to knock him out before he... Uh, there we go. Before he's um out of the net. Let's see. Let's just go for headshots. I should have prepared the gun first. That would have been the smart thing to do. There we go. That's a headshot. Nice. So we got like a minute. I'm looking at the timer on the recording. We probably have like maybe like... 45 seconds now <laughs> i don't exactly know okay i'm gonna try and time this out well though actually you know what i feel like it's probably almost out like this rifle is really good i don't want to mess up there we go nice we got it okay so i might just let this thing starve here for a little bit uh i didn't bring any sanguine elixirs but then again i brought a ton of blood and everything in the last episode and i just ended up getting buckets more so we can easily just attack a couple things and just get more blood that way oh look that time he used one and he healed but what what is that did i miscount the amount of blood packs i put in there earlier i might have i thought it said like 48 before maybe it did i don't even know i'd have to check the footage at this stage anyway uh well we have the wolf down uh oh my god look at all these things that, that are just still on here i wish you could get rid of them without having to hunt them down uh somehow the fjord hawk duplicated by the way i don't ask me how <laughs> it's the exact same one wait no it's not oh the stats are different when the hell did i start taming you i don't even understand anyway that uh that dude is gonna be okay so yeah we'll uh we'll grab hopefully an office from somewhere oh is this more wolves over here Let's see yes yes they are oh, 168 and that's the pack leader so we already know what the high level is let's go ahead and grab that one and mine <laughs> okay don't don't attack me please don't attack me all right and let's try and get in there so don't worry i'm gonna put this down into the same room beside the other one but as you might know if you've played arc for like a long time um you know two unconscious creatures or i guess one unconscious creature of the same type beside the other one won't ruin it so here we go just drop you there so see it's still good and i'm pretty sure i would have totally hit that uh where exactly is the dar wolf is it right below me yeah okay I guess I could actually just latch, right? Ooh. Okay, can we latch here? Let me latch. Ugh. Okay, wait, is it space? Or yeah, I think it's space to latch, right? No, oh, that's not working out. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, yeah, we need to get into the big room. Here we go. Uh, so yeah, I guess I could just shoot it on like this. Get like one or two shots in. I'd prefer to not have to use a net every single time. That would be great. I don't know. We could probably try this. He is mate boosted, unfortunately. So it's going to take a little bit longer to knock it out. But yeah, if it did bite towards that, provided that, you know, I mean, like it, it's not going to do anything. So don't worry. I've done this before and people kind of like freaked out a little bit in the comments. I just want to warn you against it. Like you can tame an Anki beside a Dodic. They're not going to hurt each other. Like unless the creatures can hurt each other in the wild, they can't do it when they're knocked out like that. Okay, I need to try and get a headshot on you, buddy. Freaking wolves look so cool though. Ooh, okay. Thought that was gonna be a headshot. Totally should have been one. Okay, I should probably use my crossbow a little bit too, because I don't want to waste all my trank darts. Let's see. Uh arrows. Boom. We got a really good crossbow here as well. It's got like 222 damage. So yeah. I'm not really worrying about the health of these dudes. Oh, that should have hit. It technically did. It just didn't count. Can I do this? Hey, it worked. Okay, you're actually... Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I guess that's another thing. We can see when the creature's health is low when we're knocking them out. Nice. So I guess I can use the crossbow and then just switch to darts when they get low. Hmm, that could work. All right, cool. So we got two wolves out, a male and a female. That's how you make babies. Cool. Um, Let's see. We got to actually hunt down some sheep at some point. Here's the thing. I'm not sure if I've even seen any over here. So we're going to have to probably go take a look for them. Uh, maybe on the, in the, what do I want to start calling it Midgard, but I also just feel like I keep calling it the overworld. That is an Arthyla. It's beautiful. <laughs> can I pick it up? Probably not, right? Yeah, thought so. It's weird how you can pick up Daedons with this thing though. Like, doesn't make any sense to me. Wait, I didn't even check the levels on these dudes. I probably should have. Uh, oh, you're the pack leader. What level are you? I thought they might've been the same, um... The same pack as like the one that I grabbed from before, which were like right around here, I could have sworn. Or maybe they were over there. I'm not sure. Okay, we'll be fine. We'll just do this. Come on, let me mount. There we go. Okay, what? Am I? I'm on the outside. No. Okay. That was weird. I didn't like that. Um, yeah, there we go. Another 174 though. That's amazing. Uh, is this where the head is? Yes. Nice. I can't even see. I'm just, just taking a, a little guess here. Oh, actually, I want to use the crossbow, damn it. And I think it's already running. This is a really quick turnaround, though. I mean, like, I honestly thought we'd be looking for a while, but, like, right here, there's just a ton in this, like, little red forest area. Um, I'm kind of nervous about shooting it if it's right there. So, yeah, let's, let's wait for it to, like, not be beside my one that I already have knocked out, although this one is a better level. Um, let's gamma down. Let me, okay, let's go gamma, like, 2.5, just so it's a little bit brighter, but it's not too bright. Ah, uh, come on. You're going to make me end up damaging my one yeah i don't even want to risk that it's too risky oh no it's gonna get out <laughs> should probably just dart it right now um that's actually a good spot for you to get knocked out in but you didn't take that dart amazing okay this is risky okay <laughs> you gotta be super close to being knocked out are you being serious right now can you just drop please we gotta get used to playing in third person. Arc 2 is gonna be third person only. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Yeah, cool. Um, let's go ahead and get you on the tracker as well. At some point soon, I should probably start looking for that mutton because we've got three little wolfies here ready to go fairly soon. Um, all right, well, I guess we're going to keep looking for some more of them around here. There was that other one, but it was a low level beside that Thyla. Um, I should actually quickly just gather some blood from some creatures here because I'm going to need like 600 blood and you know it shouldn't take too long to get but I want to make sure I have it all for when these guys are uh, ready to team up um I'm kind of thinking like how many more do I go for like we could probably go with the amount that we have now and still be good but I don't know go ahead and harvest all the blood off the styla as it bleeds me out as well freaking bleed on these dudes are insane okay there we go got you 43 blood okay gonna keep going let's see anything else around here what is that over there mammoth um yeah let's just keep looking over here i think if we can find like one more good level then i'd probably just tame all four and then just head back um in fact why do we even need to head back we could just stay here and massacre a bunch of creatures uh yeah i also will need that blood so i should probably start working on that right now I seriously wish that you could pick up Ankies with these things because I've been really wanting to fly over to the volcanic island back in the uh, Midgard. <laughs> See that? 
Uh, yeah, I've been really wanting to do that just so I can grab myself like an X Anki because they look way cooler than normal Ankies, you know? Um, Got to go for the biome variants whenever we can. So, yeah, I don't know. I just really wanted to do that. But unfortunately, I'd have to tame it over there or else get something else like an RG to bring it back. Uh, oh, hello, random wolves here. Why do I keep picking you up? It's too hard to check the level. Let's see. Oh, that was a 174 Anki. Oops. Like I said, our Ankies or X Ankies would be cooler. Uh, th yeah, these two are terrible. Let's just murderize everything. Come on. Ugh. Get in here. Got you. Get this last one. It's got freaking yellow on it. Look at that. Wait, let me pick you up for a sec. Oh, I killed you. Never mind. <laughs> All right, we got enough blood for one elixir. Hey, I guess we could just go around and scavenge a bunch of bodies around here. Got another pack of wolves here. A uh, bunch of them, actually. Got some there and some over here. Oh, man. Actually, there's way more than I thought. I thought there was only two here, but there's four. Okay, that thing's dead. Let me just check their levels. Uh, pack leader level 30. So let's just kill these ones first. I already know this one's a low level because it wasn't the pack leader. And dead. Also level 30. Nice. Oh, I should... Wait, did I eat that bot? Okay, yeah. I guess I did. Weird. Um, all right. So the pack leader's in the back there. Uh, that's not the pack leader. Oh, no, they did their little... Oh, we got a 174. Nice. Is it just the one 174 or is there another, like, high level here as well? Just, I'm thinking of a... Yeah, you know what? Never mind. I was about to, like, massacre them all, but I guess we could just leave it. All right, I think I got the 174. It kind of looks like a cow. <laughs> it's got, like, cow colors. Uh, you are the 174, correct? Yes. Okay, if you could kindly stop ripping me apart as we fly you here, that would be great. Okay, let's drop you there. Nice. Uh, and just kind of mount up here. Pretty much do the... What am I mounted onto? Wait, hang on. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you know what? That works. Um, where are you? There you are. Let's just, uh... We'll start off with the, with the darts just so we can, um... Make it, like, run away from me quicker. That way I can actually go down. Uh, okay, that should be a headshot. Nice. Oh, what? No, that wasn't a headshot. What the hell? That's so cheap. That's not fair. <laughs> uh... I don't know if it's running. Let's just drop down. It will only hit me a little bit. Listen to all these sleepy puppies. <laughs> You're gonna join them. Yeah, this is actually kind of perfect. It's just being like right here. Because I'm able to get headshots <laughs> and it's stuck on me. Nice. Okay, don't 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 unstick yourself somehow. Hey! Got it. Alright. Oh man. Alright. Well look at this. We got freaking four direwolves, all like super high level. No max levels though, but it's okay. So what do we get? We got three 174s and a 168. And three of these. Okay. I just heard battle music. I thought maybe something was around. Three of our... Uh, oh, we just... We're like one blood short. <laughs> three of our dudes here are... Uh, are Well, not our dudes. They're, they're three ladies is what I'm really trying to say. And I'm really struggling. Um, We got some mammoths here we can kill real quick. Let's do that just to get this last little bit of blood that we're going to need. Um, we've got an RG there too. Yeah, uh, this little village is really cool. I like this spot. Honestly, I kind of want to build here. But at the same time, like if I just keep building in all these like little houses and rooms and stuff, like we're not going to have cool bases, you know? The most I could do to these bases is decorate the inside. You know, it's already there. But honestly, I feel like this is the perfect map to play. Like if you guys remember Survival Plus, you guys remember that mod? That mod was fantastic. Just playing that on here would be amazing. It totally would. Um, even playing the hunted on here actually might even work too, but maybe not with some of these new critters. But yeah, I don't know. It's like, uh, it's almost kind of like the type of server you'd want everybody to not really have super good stuff. Or even, I guess, if we went back and just redid the medieval um, arc stuff that we had a little while ago. That was probably like two years ago. If you guys remember that, I basically set up a bunch of custom configs no mods for any of it and just kind of made it so you could really only tame you know realistic things so like everybody was running around on like rhinos and mammoths and stuff like you couldn't really tame t-rexes or carnos or any of those types of guys it was great though i loved it it was like mostly kind of focusing on like herbivores pretty much that was like your best stuff um but now i, I we couldn't really do that with those same settings because dialas have an insane bleed nowadays let's see let's do that we got two we just need one more um, this Dodic might help with that. But yeah, I don't know. Just doing something something similar to those types of servers on here would probably be great because of these houses. 
And gotcha. Nice. Uh, oh, that's an elixir. That's not blood. Uh, okay, so we just need less than 100. Let's get this uh, dude over here. This is an owl. Hello. Is that an R owl? It kind of looks like one. Guess you can tell by the eyes. The eyes on the normal owls are like a kind of like a lighter blue. These ones are like super dark. Oh, and it's 174. Oops. It's all good. It's all good. I die a little bit inside sometimes when I kill super high levels like that of creatures that I totally would have tamed. But there's no point of checking absolutely everything. I'm about to go bite. So yeah, let me... Can we pick you up? No, but let's go ahead and kill you. Actually, you know what? I gotta say, I really enjoyed seeing Dimetrodons in uh, the new Jurassic World movie. No spoilers about the scene itself, but yes, they are in the movie. Big spoilers there. And oh, we're so close. Oh, hello. You'll help with that. Okay, so now we got the four elixirs. All I need to do is find an Ovis. Again, no idea if they spawn here. Have not seen one. Might have to head back. We should be okay to do that, though. I might need to grab some narcotic for these guys soon, though. You know what I really could have done? I could have just brought an Ovis with me, because I have some tamed now. Yeah, we could have just slaughtered one. I guess we still can do that. All right, I guess that's, that's what we're doing. Um, This is an easy spot to find. Let's just uh, Let's just teleport back. Um, I don't know where I want to go. Vanilland South, right? That's where I spawned. Uh, that's not Vanilland South. I don't know. Let's just, let's, let's go here. This, oh, I forgot. Yeah, we got lots of spots to check from. <laughs> let's just go there. That, that works. Now, I'm really hoping that going from a realm does not somehow reset everything here. That would be the worst, but I guess we'll find out the hard way if we're going to lose these guys. I really doubt that we would, but at the same time, I have no idea. <laughs> okay, we're gonna find out soon. Uh, we are here. Where? Oh, interesting. So Asgard is five kilometers underground over in this direction. <laughs> cool. I mean, it makes sense, right? Like, wait, where the hell are we? Okay, now I know. I thought that this coast was the same coast that we spawned on initially. Oh, this is that really cool. Yeah, we gotta just take a quick little peek. We can't not... Look at this as we fly by. Look at this. So amazing. Um, yeah. So the, the realms are, are basically like below the map. That makes a lot of sense. It's kind of the same like with uh, boss arenas on the island. I think that they're all below the map as well. Grab that real quick. Nice. Got 19 out of 200. Okay. Um, there's lots of really cool things to see here, but we're just going to pass through. We just got to get back to base. We got to go ahead and grab an Ovis and then head back over to Asgard. All right, I might just bring two just in case. All right, so Asgard South brought me to the wrong red forest area. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Where exactly are we? I mean, you can't even really look at the map. It's kind of pointless. Like, it doesn't show the realms. I really wish that we could see the realms somehow, like extra maps. I don't know. It, it would probably not be the easiest thing for them to actually be able to do, but I don't know. That would be great. Um, I just figured that this would be closer, which I don't know whether it is or not. Okay, my bad. I think that we're still in the same red forest. Yeah, it's just a gigantic biome. Man, I didn't even realize it. Honestly, Asgard is massive. It really is. Like, it doesn't look that big when you're just kind of, like, looking around the landscape, but there's a lot to this place. All right. Well, that first one's probably starved down enough. I don't know about the rest. Where's the entrance? Oh, is that a rune? Huh. Nice. Grab that real quick. Lovely. And I guess we'll bring the bat inside just in case. Uh, okay, cool. So I have two of us here. Hit the wrong button there. Nice. Let's just get this one ready. Um, yeah, we could probably just bludgeon you with this. I know I could use the S plus kill gun, but like, I just want people to know that this is an option, even on PvE. You can just come right up to it and, and, and slaughter it. I love that. Honestly, that's such a great option. Uh, let's go ahead and do this. Getting lots and lots of pelt here as well, which I'll probably have to drop because it's super heavy. Boom. Uh, okay. Let's see. So, doo -doo, which is the first one? Is this the first one I knocked out? Maybe. I mean, we could just feed it all the, the mutton. Like, that will get it tamed. Let's go ahead and just drop in an elixir anyway. <laughs> we can't not have fun with these new items. Uh, boom. Oh, wait, no. You use a Poseidon, right? Ah, never mind. <laughs> it's already up. Wow, okay. Yeah, I think you have to use it beside them, right? I don't know. Let's let's try this out. Um, so this one over here is probably almost kind of ready. Drop in a bunch and let me use the elixir. Boom. So that should have 
There we go, lovely. And you are up. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Okay. Let's dump in the, all the food and then... Uh, there we go. Elixir. It's not necessary. I mean, like, we could totally get away with not doing this. Nice. <laughs> can you use it first? No. Wait, no. I guess you can. Did that work? It did work. Oh, crap. I just realized. Is that messing up its tame then? No, I think we should be good. Right? I'm just worried that uh, not having, like, the food in there then would have messed it up. But we should be good. Yeah, it came out as a 260 anyway. All right, perfect. Let's pick up all of you and let's take a little look at their stats. Oh, some of them are in the bar. Um, okay, so 41 melee on that one's pretty good. Terrible health though. Uh, 44 melee, nice. Uh, that one's got very mixed stats. And then this one here's got 44 on the stem. Okay, so none of them are like absolutely amazing. I mean, even 44 melee, we could definitely get better than that. So it, it's just a start though. Let's um, let's get out here. Let's, can I go through that? Probably not. Let me fit through here. Let me see, where do I want to go? Probably out of the forest so I can at least see where I'm going. You know what, what I really want to do? Let's uh, let's go hunt down this Andrew Sarkis. We need these creatures to disappear off the creature tracker and this is going to be the only way to make that happen. So. Let's take the little pack of darwolves over and we'll uh, just slaughter this thing and its friends. Oh, what? It just disappeared. Really? <laughs> That's annoying. I was I was going to hunt you down. Ah, damn. All right. Well, yeah, I guess it just despawned like as we came into range. So like the game thinks it's still there, but it, it really wasn't. No biggie. We can easily just, you know, ravage through its friends anyway, which are probably high levels. But like I said, you know, we're not going to be taming these guys. It's not going to matter. Why did you come out as a slightly lower level? Did the elixir help? <gasps> oh, I get it. Yeah. Okay. So this 260 was their kibble level, I would imagine. And, uh, you know, mutton's really good, but it's, it's not the best thing to feed to them. Interesting. Okay, well, there we go. Uh, we, we elixired. I don't know if this one got elixir, did it? Let me check. Oh, wait, we're gonna have to fight these guys. So never mind. Uh, ready? Yeah, here we go. I'm not even on the pack later. Uh, <laughs> oh man, I am too fat as well. No, I'm too fat. I'm gonna have to get onto the moment with the best weight. Um, all right, do it. Come on, boys. Here you go. Come on, get it done. Perfect. So proud of you. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, let me just quickly take a look at these dudes then. I think I elixired three of them then, right? Yeah, so 99.1 is their elixir plus mutton. And then this 98.8 is the, the one that, the very first one, which is the one that, um, I didn't get to use the elixir on because I was too slow and I didn't realize how to use them. Okay, interesting. Well, we get slightly better effectiveness with using that. So, like, definitely need to be using that no matter what from now on. Um, I do need to drop some stuff here. Actually, let's just drop out all these guys first. Uh, definitely gonna have to drop that and those and probably can drop that and the mutton as well. Boom. And what else can I drop? That is not hardly gonna help at all. I can drop those. Um, okay, wait, which one has the best weight? You have 299, three, okay, three, yeah, that one's the highest so far. Okay, so this is the one that we're going to ride on, the lowest level, which is kind of disappointing. So instead, we're actually going to ride on, I think, this one? Yeah, because I can level this one up and have this one be the, uh, the pack leader, which, you know, of course allows us to control how they, um, they do their little boost. But there we go! All right, come on, everybody follow me. Can we run around quick? We're kind of slow. Yeah, it's okay. We'll make it work. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, yeah, I forgot that's how they worked. No, come help me. Here we go. Nice. Okay, this mammoth is toast. Oh, yeah, this is going to make it a lot easier to deal with all the creatures, like, around my area, actually. You know what? I got a better idea. I got a better idea. Let's, um, let's ride on LeChonk. <laughs> this makes more sense. I have my minions now instead of uh, being on one of them. Here we go. Let's just take out all these Yankees. There's far too many Yankees in Asgard. Like, I didn't see any of these in the Thor movies, so I don't know if it, this is, like, a, just a Norse mythology thing, having Yankees around, but, yeah. 
definitely weird. Like, there's literally like five billion Ankies on this freaking biome. Why were you slow? Okay, let's take out this other one. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, there's nothing more satisfying than having like a little war pack and just running around like this. Okay, yeah, they're not gonna attack him anymore. I, ha I gotta finish him off. And almost. There we go. Perfect. Okay, let's uh let's go over here. Let's take out the Stegos and this dude as well. Oh, we got tons of Andrew Starkus here. This is what they get for being frustrating tames. <laughs> Come on, take him out. Almost got him. Come on. There you go. A little bit more. A little bit. Yay. There we go. Sweet. Oh, actually, you know what? I completely forgot. We were, uh, why is it so like saturated looking through here? It looks like the brightness is turned up to like 11. That's so weird looking. What? Why is it like that? Is it, is it kind of like an effect because I'm in the darkness in there? Maybe. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, okay. There we go. Uh, so what I, I did want to do was actually name the, uh, the Fjord Hawk because I got so many suggestions for this thing, like an absolute crap ton. And, um, you know, we, we get the, oh, stop. Okay. You're falling a chunk. That's fine. I was about to say, cause like in the last episode, it just started flying off in like a random ass direction. I was very confused about that, but yeah, we get, you know, a fair few cringy names for them. You know, I'm not going to name it Hawkeye. Like that is the most basic bitch thing to name it. I'm sorry. You know, we got lots of ones like Stephen Hawking and stuff like that. But this one, I was like, okay, this is actually kind of funny. So here we go. <laughs> Oh, it's, it's so silly. <laughs> so Harrison Fjord. That's great. We can just call him Harrison. There we go. <laughs> I like it. You know, like, I I don't like, I'm not the type of person to name my Giga, like, Gigabyte. Like, you know, everybody does that. You want to be different. Um, But yeah, Stephen Hawking, like, come on. <laughs> and then we got, like, what else was there? Hawkeye. There was, like, there was so many like that. And I just like i get it you know they're they're nice names i just everybody's gonna name their thing that i don't know how many people are gonna name it harrison Fjord. <laughs> but yeah there we go i like it um still pretty basic but i do like it all right let's can these guys keep up with me probably not you gotta stop every so often let's see we got some gas bags over here i do actually kind of want to tame up one of these dudes now obviously we can easily transfer uh okay Okay, <laughs> it's a 180. Huh. I mean, I can tame it, but I'm not like, I don't have kibble for it. And they, they're gonna, it's gonna require berries, which is gonna ruin its effectiveness. Hmm. Can you net them? If you can net them, I'll tame it. I was just gonna say like, we could get one soon, but like, I don't want to ruin a 180. That's a 170. What is happening? Are you like a 168? No, okay. What is that weird glitch that's happening again? What is with that? That is so strange. All right, well, uh, let me see. We can test and see if we can net them. Yeah, you can net them. Green on this means you can net them. Uh, I guess you can't net an Andrew Sarkis? Interesting. Maybe it's because of the saddle. Uh, oh, wait, no. It's probably because they're my tames, which means I can still net them. I think maybe yellow means that you can't net them or something. Anyway, uh, we can net this thing. Let's see, you are the 180, right? Ah, oh, dude, that's so annoying. Okay. Ah, uh, all right, let's pick them all up. I just, I was going to say it could be a great tame to bring items around. Like, aspects are kind of fun in general as well. Um, but yeah, I mean, like, we can use the Fjord Hawk and it's little, like, nice exploit is what I want to call it. But it's really just a feature. <laughs> it's nice little feature. It is, like, a good way of bringing items from A to B. But uh, at the same time, like, you know, is it... Uh, is it going to be the only way I'm going to want to collect stuff? Probably not. Let's do that. There we go. Uh, where the hell is your head? Uh, also, that's kind of horrifying looking. It's like smushed in. What did I do to you? Oh, I'm so sorry. Where, where the hell is your head? Where is your head? Is it here? Why are you hardly taking any damage? Oh, he's still blown up. No, or she. Crap. Okay, we might not be able to knock this thing out. Probably not. Uh, in fact, let me use the crossbow. Come on probably not gonna be able to do this it's got tons of air left in it so this definitely wasn't the best way of doing it i should have tried to get the air out of it so we can deal more damage I'll just try and keep doing this i don't think it's gonna go out though it's too blown up come on you can just see the air leaving it every 
every shot it just like a little fart come on a little bit more oh man all right Ooh, come on there we go yeah it's, it's gonna peace out here in a minute probably not gonna be able to get another net onto it in time just keep shooting at it come on let me do it uh no no you don't no no <laughs> oh man all right I, I guess we could chase it i mean we're gonna be able to net it soon it's just it's gonna be full of air again and it's going really really far okay gotta chase it down should be able to net you maybe now oh! <laughs> oh he's gonna do his thing he's gonna gas me okay wait does that stop him from flying oh is he trying to hit me right now i think he might be <laughs> no let's do that we could actually have uh lechonk attack a little bit but it's fine actually we could have easily netted it right there i feel okay let's do, do this haha -ha! okay i want to just quickly check Ooh, there it is uh okay you know what we're kind of getting there maybe possibly look at <laughs> he's so upset <laughs> you can hear the gas leaking what <laughs> okay let's uh hopefully get this thing down maybe possibly it might happen it's gonna take a couple nets though there's no way it's gonna get down right now come on if we could deflate it a little bit before netting it that would be great but it's definitely not gonna be possible without hurting it a lot come on if only i had bullets though actually i could shoot it out of the sky i didn't bring any unfortunately gonna get out now in a second here oh the chunk uh okay it's fine well uh ah get away go away go away seriously you're not part of this go away come on eh, let me hit you oh what oh there we go now we're hitting i was about to say we're not hitting at all probably was too high potentially come on there we go got you okay what is it doing <laughs> it wants me oh you just gassed me oh no 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 okay i was about to say little hyanodon oh god he's so chunky Okay, let me kill this dude real okay never mind never mind <laughs> so uh, let's get this going get the net in okay and let's just get this reloaded as well let's just get lechonk on follow um i can probably just run after it a little bit boom okay yeah i think maybe i'll let it land and then at that point oh crap it's flying towards andrew sarkis that point it's not gonna have that much gas in it right perfect maybe i don't know let's just use the darts now okay do more darts i'm gonna actually quickly check its torpor now uh there it is and you are oh god we're so far okay uh yeah let's use some darts it is still full of air right now right a little bit maybe shoot you in the mouth <laughs> uh all right, let me get that uh, net gun reloaded, and I want to get the magnifying glass on my hotbar as well. Boom. Is it running towards me? Oh, it totally is. It wants to be tamed. I'm telling you. Look at this. Come here. Come on. Keep coming. Should be able to... Oh, okay. I was about to say we should net it soon, but could probably do it now, right? Uh, Yes nice okay let's quickly check this what it's filling up <laughs> it just filled up anyway yeah okay it's we're letting out the air i don't think it's making a difference at all in terms of resistance so yeah just keep popping these in hopefully we'll have this thing teamed up in a little bit here come on okay i'm gonna check its torpor okay yeah we're getting kind of close but i feel like we're we're gonna have to just run around after it now in a minute just shoot at it because it's totally not going to go out before this net goes away and that is indeed my last one you're at oh you're so close Ooh, let's do this there we go it's definitely going to break out any second now though come on and it's gone all right um at this point it's a matter of like where do i want it to get knocked out because I guess I can kind of choose by just, you know, although it might, yeah, no, it's Torpor running for me, right? Yeah, I think it is. Come on, Andrew Sarkis. We got to chase this thing. There's an Andrew Sarkis over there. That's kind of bad. Oh, there's a freaking scorpion too. No. Okay. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Um, 
Okay, come here. Lechonk, we gotta take these guys out. <laughs> okay, I guess it's flying past them. That's fine. Uh, okay, we still gotta take them out, though, because they're super close. Come on. There we go. Got you two. Nope, the scorpion fully healed. Never mind. Come on. Die. Thank you. Okay, where the hell is this thing gone? Is this it? Yeah, this is it, right? I think so. Uh, I don't feel comfortable with this Andrew Sarkis right here. I gotta kill this thing as well. And probably also that Cantro, but we might be okay. Uh, it's totally gonna aggro onto us, right? Yeah, it's definitely gonna aggro the Cantro. Uh, maybe not. Might be good. Okay, let me check. What are you at? Oh, you're so close. Oh, okay, wait, wait, wait. Gotta wait for that Cantro to at least move away or something. Okay, let's do it. Ooh, it's, got, it's out? No, it's not out. Okay, one more. Hey, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna kill this dude. All right, all right, all right. Let's see. Actually, we should also not harvest these bodies because I'm going to need another elixir. Okay, there we go. We got you. Um, we've basically just got the stegos here. That's about it. We're pretty good here. Let's grab those and put you away. Pull out plasma. Okay, so we got the gas bags on tracking. And let's see. Do we have anything else around here? Just the stegos, basically. But yeah, just in general, though, guys, I think I'll probably just have this thing tamed up by the start of the next episode. Because, um, yeah, we got to finish off this recording soon uh, before we find something else that I want to tame. So, uh, yeah, guys, go ahead. Do me a favor. Hit the like button if you enjoyed this one. And, uh, yeah, catch you in the next one.